Omaha, Nebraska. You know, I've said many times on my bucket list, while people are thinking going to white sandy beaches or maybe on an incredible cruise or a trip to Europe, I'd like to see a cornfield in Nebraska. Don't ask me why. Maybe it's just my love of farming or that part of the world. But there's another reason why Nebraska is on my mind and Omaha happens to be the place today. On this date in 1924, a young man by the name of Marlon Brando was born. He passed away back in 2004. He was 80 years of age. Academy Award winner, Time Magazine, one of the most 100 influential people of the century. American Film Institute voted him the fourth most popular actor of all time. That I would disagree. I think as far as acting goes and everyone who has come since, they will simply say they wanted to be like Brando, a method actor by trade and someone that poured his heart and soul into every role. And yeah, he is known for that performance as Vito Corleone in The Godfather and of course on the waterfront, truly one of the greatest of all time. And he's made a lot of other movies that I think were just as special. But one in particular, the Turner Classic Movies ran earlier today and I've seen it before. I didn't get a chance to watch it today but hopefully a little Comcast on demand later when I have some downtime, I will. Mutiny on the Bounty, 1962. It was in Tahiti, and he fell in love so much with the place that he ended up buying an island there. You know, Marlon Brando truly was a man for all seasons and can do just about anything in front of that camera. And that motion picture in particular with the great Richard Harris and also fellow Brit Trevor Howard was one of my favorites because when you're a young man and you dream of many things, a lot of it has to do with sailing off to sea. It really was an epic adventure, but it truly shows the incredible talent of Marlon Brando, who I believe died way too young and he'll had a lot of work still ahead of him. But today, I thought I'd take a little time to remember Brando. I think you know exactly who I'm talking about. Good night.